Daily News Now, John Last is live at the Ice Center. He found out the memories of today will stay with Sapolsky as he travels to the Winter Games. John. If Ryan Sapolsky did not know before today that people in Erie are very proud of him, he surely knows now. He was surprised today at this very arena by the mayor and by Mercyhurst, his college alma mater. Ryan Sapolsky had the day all planned out a workout at the Mercyhurst Ice Center, the place where he played his college hockey. Then he would take time to answer questions from reporters. But Sapolsky soon learned there would be more than questions and answers. There would be some surprises. Erie Mayor Joe Schember was there, and he issued a proclamation from the people of Erie calling Sapolsky a role model for kids everywhere. This is exciting and that would just be wonderful to see him go on and lead that team to a, a gold medal. We'll see what happens, but whatever he does, we're so pleased and honored to have him there representing Erie. Mercyhurst University also had a surprise. The school announced that it is retiring Zapolsky's number 35. His former coach, Rick Godkin, presented him with a framed sweater. You know what, there's only been one other jersey that's been fully retired, and that number 17, Scott Burfoot who played here in the, in the early 90s and, and whatnot. So it's a, it's a big deal. You know, you don't do that lightly. Uh, you don't do that all the time. Sapolsky has been honored by being named goalie for the U.S. Olympic hockey team. And for an athlete, it doesn't get any better than that. But he says the honors bestowed upon him on this day in his hometown are pretty special, too. Really special. I didn't expect either that. I didn't know they kept it from me, I think, till today, so I was surprised. But it's, it's amazing to have this. Um, this whole process has been a, an incredible experience for me, and um, just, just really happy to be here and represent Erie Mercy Earth. It's, it's the honor of a lifetime, it really is. He's an example of what uh, a middle-class family in a working-class city, if you actually just put your mind to something that you love to do, and uh, there's... there's Nothing can stop you if you really want to do it. Ryan deserves all the accolades he gets, but his dad says that's not what his son is all about. Ryan, he says, just loves to play hockey. Reporting live from Mercyhurst University, John Last, Erie News Now. All right, thanks, John.